What up guys, this is Mar305151 and today I'm going to be showing you how to get VNC Viewer 4 for the iPhone, iPhone 3G, iPod Touch 1st and 2nd generation running on the firmware 2.2.1. For those of you who do not know what VNC Viewer 4 is, it is a program that you install in, onto your PC and you can control your iPhone or iPod Touch through your computer meaning that you do not have to have your phone right next to you in order to use it as long as you have the program and you know how to use it you're good to go you can have your phone in another room and you you'll be able to use send text messages do anything that you would do with your phone or iPod touch right in front of you you'll be able to do it through the computer with that being said I'm going to show you how to get this and let's get to it Let's do the phone part so we could get through, um, so we could finish with the phone part because this is really easy. You're going to want to open Cydia, click on search, click on the search part, and you're going to want to type this down. V-E-E-N-C-Y. Once you type that down, you will see this right here. Okay, that is what you're going to want to type down, and you're going to want to click on it. And for those of you who cannot make it out, I will have it to the right on the video description under more info. You're going to want to install it and confirm it. Once you install it, just click on the home button and you're done with your, the iPhone for now. Okay? Just one quick thing. The requirements for this, you do need to have a jailbroken iPhone or iPod Touch and you also need to have Wi-Fi connection. Without Wi-Fi, you will not be able to run the program okay you're gonna want to go once you download the application from Cydia oh and don't worry about it you will not have an applic you won't have an icon on your springboard for the application that you had just downloaded okay once you do that onto your phone you will want to go to un, under my more info on the video description to the right you will want to click on the link that I'm going to provide for you guys in order to get the um, install the program onto your phone onto your PC just in case the link does not work this is, is what this is what you're gonna want to write on your internet browser on the search bar or whatever it is www.soft82.com forward slash download forward slash windows forward slash vnc dash free dash edition forward slash okay once you get on this page you're gonna see vnc free edition 4.1.3 you're gonna want to click on free download once you click on free download it will take you to another page and you're gonna see mirror one you're gonna wanna click on mirror one and this will pop up you're gonna wanna save it save it onto your desktop okay be sure make sure you save it to your desktop okay you save it once you save it and everything finish saving you can just forget about this website you are done with it and you will not need it anymore okay once you save it to your desktop you would have this icon right here that says VNC 413 right there you are going to want to click on it and this will pop up saying do you want to run this file yet you are going to want to run it I'm just gonna continue okay you're gonna want to click on next gonna want to accept the agreement I'm gonna click next 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 and next when you get here you are going to want to check the first box which says create a VNC viewer desktop icon which this will give you a desktop icon onto your desktop so you can just you know get it from right there on the desktop and you don't have to search your whole computer once you click next once you check the box and you click next, it's going to say click install. You're going to install it. And then this should pop up. You don't have to worry about it. Just click OK. Then click next and finish. 
and as you can see I have the desktop icon right there there it goes okay you're gonna wanna click on it and this will pop up once you click on it where it says server the server that you're gonna wanna type down is your IP address for the Wi-Fi that you are going to be using gonna wanna go on to settings gonna wanna go to Wi-Fi and you're gonna wanna click on the Wi-Fi that you are using and sorry guys but I'm gonna cover my IP address and there you go your IP address you're gonna wanna write it down um, number for number exactly how it is so just give me a quick second while I type down my IP address okay once you type down the IP address you will go right here and click OK okay then the little screen will disappear and you will have a pop up right here on your phone you're gonna wanna accept it okay once you accept it just give me a quick second okay once you accept it you can automatically see that there is the the program okay you can see right here flip the page it flips the page okay I can flip pages and the computer does what I do okay okay I'm gonna show you the controls on how to use this just give me a quick second alright as you can see under my notes you can see a little X that is pretty much your finger on your iPhone or iPod touch okay let's say okay the mouse you use it and you maneuver the, the X or of course if it's with the computer you use the mouse let's say you want to go to calculator you just put the little X on top of the calculator icon and you click this button right here or for the mouse it would be this button right here so you're going to want to click on it and there you go you're on your calculator okay you could just click you know right here 8 divided by 8 equals and it will give you the answer and as you can see it's doing exactly the same thing on your iPhone or iPod Touch. Remember, your iPhone has to be open. It cannot be locked. If not, it won't work. Okay? Alright, to go back home, right here, you click here. This, this is the trigger to trigger it home. Or if it's on the mouse, it's this one right here. Okay, the middle finger so we're gonna click on home and it goes straight back home if you want to write a text message just click on text messages okay I'm gonna get out a new text message okay you just go there and you can use your keyboard as you can see I'm going to write I don't know, I'm just going to type a couple more letters and stuff right there. And as you can see, it does work. Okay, uh, then all you have to do is go here to send it. You just, you know, do it like a regular, like if you're maneuvering it. And there you go. Click back home, and it goes to the home page. To flip through pages, you go here, and you click right here. On this side, to go back. You get on this side with the X and you just click and it goes back. And there you go. That is VNC Viewer 4 for the iPhone, iPhone 3G, iPod Touch 1st and 2nd generation running on the firmware 2.2.1. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If any of you guys have any questions on the video on how to, or how to install it, please feel free to comment me or personal message me and I'll help you guys out okay um please um rate comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys soon peace